Hello, and welcome to Module 11 of Setting up a Journal in OGS 3.3, Distribution Settings. This module is quite large and we've broken it into several units. This unit is License. In this section, we'll configure settings around copyright and licensing of materials submitted to and published by your journal. To access, log in to your dashboard through the top right corner of your journal's page. In the left navigation menu, we can go to the distribution settings. License is the first tab of the distribution settings. OGS will automatically generate copyright notices on each item published in your journal. And the following item will help us configure that setting. First, we'll have to indicate who the copyright holder of the materials will be. Is it going to be the author, the journal, or are we going to work with a custom copyright statement? Selecting the latter will display a new field where we can write our copyright statement. Then we can choose the license. Licensing differs from copyright because it defines how material can be used rather than who has the legal ownership of the material. Here, we can determine what type of usage license should be applied to the materials in your journal. But if you are using a different license, you can select other license and provide a URL to the license if it's available. In the next section, you can choose if the copyright year will be based on the, on the issue's publication date or the article's publication date. You can also add any other license terms that you would like to be displayed along with the published work. Once you're happy with your changes, you can click on Save. If for some reason you need to reset the stored permissions to update information, you can use the Reset Article Permissions button that can be found going to your left navigation bar to the Tools option and then in the Permissions tab. If you have completed your settings, don't forget to save them. This concludes our overview on the license settings. Thanks for watching. I'll see you again in the next module.